It could happen to any of us. The simple act of eating lunch and suddenly you're choking. When that happened to a Goodwill employee in Fairfield, the quick thinking of a co-worker saved his life. Nine on Your Side reporter Scott Wegener shows us why words simply weren't enough to say thank you. Really, it was the best thing ever happened to me. It's sometimes hard to put into words the depth of gratitude you feel when someone saves your life. I knew if it wasn't for Brenda, I wouldn't be here. It all started when Jeremy Perry took a break from his job at Goodwill in Fairfield. Like many of us, he started eating too fast. It was lunch and I was eating the snack at the same time. Then all it took was a minor distraction. A workmate told a joke. And I kind of laughed and it went down the wrong pipe. Fortunately, rehabilitation specialist Brenda Matthews was within helping distance. I noticed that his face was turning purple, so I patted him on the back, and when I realized the patent wasn't helping, helping, I knew what I had to do. Brenda was trained for the Heimlich maneuver when she started at Goodwill 13 years ago. This is the first time she needed to use it. Usually if things like that happen, I always feel like I'm going to panic, but I knew then what I had to do. And she did it without even thinking twice. As with her son, simple thank yous seemed to pale on the altar of gratitude for Jeremy's mother. So Regina Angel Lill got on the phone. I called Fairfield and talked to them and told them what had happened. As a result, Brenda's selfless act of heroism will be recognized by a council proclamation. Official gratitude from this city of 43,000 to a woman who took action when an ordinary meal became a life or death event. Scott Wegener, 9 on your side, Fairfield.